the legs are straight and now we want to see if you can come back up I'm too big for this thing man <laughs> <laughs> Boom! Welcome to another video of the Flowing Dutchman. In this video, I'm still at Nielbank Palace. We're in the gym and today's is going to be legs. So we're going to push our legs and see how far we can get. So Jai Viraj, what are we going to do in our leg workout? Good morning from Nielbank Palace. It's a good Sunday, best day to do legs. So uh, um, one thing never changes in my personal leg routine. Legs routine is uh, squats. Uh, warm up with about 50 to 100 body weight squats and then hit barbell squats from one plate working up to four plates. So that's the basic of most of my leg workouts, legs workouts. But a few things that we are going to do in this workout is we are going to give uh, some importance to our hamstrings. We're going to do uh, lying leg curls and of course uh, keep a good focus on our adductors and abductors. And, uh, do that on the machine, adduction and abduction. We're going to end with adduction and abduction on the machine. High reps again, not too heavy on the weight. We want to make sure the form is perfect and uh, try our best to feel the mind muscle connection as much as possible. What are we going to do uh, with the squats? So, we are going to um, do warm up with body weight squats, like I mentioned, about 50 to 100 body weight squats. Following that, we are going to do barbell squats. So I'm going to do um, two warm-up sets, working sets, with a 20 kg plate each side, just one plate. Uh, not too much, 15 reps, that's it. After that, I'm going to do a rest pause set. So I'm going to add 10, 10, 10 kgs. So it'll be 30 kgs, 40 kgs, 50 kgs. I'm only going to hit five reps on each weight, but with minimal rest. So the moment I start with 30 kgs each side, I'll do five reps, put the barbell back on the rack, switch the weight immediately, again five reps with 40, repeat the same with 50. Then I'll take a rest for about one minute and then progress the squats up to three plates and four plates. All right. I have no idea exactly what we're gonna do now, but I'm gonna experience it. Enjoy. <laughs> So we've done our warm-up squats. We finished 50 bodyweight squats. After that, we did uh, two sets with 20 kgs each side for 15 reps. Now we are going to do a rest pause. So we are going to do, you can see out here, it's 30 kilos each side. That's a plate of 10, that's a plate of 20. So we are going to do five reps with this. Immediately add 10 kgs, do another five. Immediately add another 10 kgs and do another five. And then we are going to take a two minute rest before we do start with three plates. So we add in 20 each side. So the rest period ends up being about 10 to 15 seconds normally. We try to switch it as fast as possible. So 
So now we're at? So we did five reps at 30 kgs each side, five reps at 40 kgs each side, and now you're going to hit five reps at 50 kgs each side. It's easy lift, come on. Ha! Let's go, two more reps. Good work, man. Good set, bro. And now? And now we take a rest for one and a half minutes. Catch your breath back and then start with three plates. Okay, so we have added another plate. So we're now at 20, 40, 60, 120, 130 kilograms. Jevraj. Yes? What are we gonna do with the 130 kilograms? So for, uh, I treat it as 120. I never count the weight on the barbell. I do. Uh, okay, <laughs> 130 for you, 120 for me. I'm lifting lighter than you. <laughs> but uh, we are going to do as maximum reps, I guess. Let's see how many reps you can uh, uh, push in. I'm going to uh, make sure that we don't compromise on form. Right. That is going to be the priority. No matter how heavy you can go, this is not a powerlifting competition. We want to make sure that we are hitting the target muscle and we are not compromising on our form as we did. Okay guys, so you know when the barbell is uh, curling like this, the weight starts to become heavy. Oh my god. Let's aim for five reps, come on. So I did two times three reps of the 130 kilograms, which is uh, a lot of weight for me. And uh, like Javiraj says, I still do primarily quadriceps uh, focused squats. So my hamstrings and glutes have some trouble activating. And that is probably why I am not really able to go up in weight that much with squats. Now, Javiraj just mounted up an extra 20 kilograms of weight, so we're now at 150, and see how many reps he can do. So uh, this is three plates and a 10 each side. So that's 100, 120, 40, 60, 70, 140 kgs each side. Uh, total total plus, weight. Plus sorry. the barbell. <laughs> no, we don't. I'm not counting the barbell weight. It's um, 70 kgs each side. I'm um, not going to do too many reps, probably get in now, uh, two or three reps, that's about it. Let's go! You got this man! Full power! So I got back to 110 kilogram. 100, 100 kgs, not 110. <laughs> the barbell does weigh something. Let's 
go, good set, come on. Focus with each step, come on. good he's going for four plates now guys that's 160 kilograms in his language 170 kilograms in my ma <laughs> in my language get one rep in this Pause squats, that's it. You're gonna squat, you're gonna pause. Hold as long as you can. Uh, full depth, as to grass, and come back up. And uh, I would prefer if you could try two to three sets. So try to compete with yourself. Now, supposing your first set, you're able to pause for five seconds. The second set, try for 10. The third set, try for 15. But the main goal should not be that if you can pause for 10 seconds, you pause for five and then pause for 10. You must give it your best and try to improve. Yeah. Yet at the same time, don't confuse yourself between knowing your limit and ego lifting. Right. So, so one rep, right? Yeah, just one rep. We are, we are just going to do one rep. Otherwise, you, you could do 10, 20 reps of pause squats, pausing after every rep. But we are going to hit a fairly decent amount of weight, which is more than our body weight, or approximately our body weight, but pause with it. All right. Nice and easy. Good. What is the main advantage of doing a pause squat, Javaraj? Um, so, to be very honest with you, the scientific reason I do not know personally, I started uh, adapting to these after I um, saw a good friend of mine who's fairly popular in the bodybuilding world called Kai Green. Shout out to Kai Green. I saw him do these and followed right away. And I've seen that pause squats have given me a fairly huge advantage as far as my hip mobility goes. So I obviously, when I was a beginner, I started with extremely lightweight. And I've seen that over time, if you notice uh, in all the videos, uh, if there's one thing that I make sure I do not do, that is to squat anything less than as to grass. So I think pause squats over time has helped my hip mobility and has definitely uh, made sure that I can squat beyond parallel. So Jaiviraj is now going to do something interesting. I haven't seen it before, but he is going to sit down all the way on the ground and then somehow get up. So since we did pause squats, the entire idea or stupidity of what I'm doing next is just to see if you can take the weight all the way down uh, and literally sit down with it so as to speak. Get your legs back in position and stand up. So uh, I don't know if I could still do this. Just let's give it a shot. So the whole point is to try and um, sit down on the floor with the weight just like this, all right? So the legs are straight and now we want to see if you can come back up, which might be a little struggle. 
but not too bad. We managed it. Like I told you, it's weird as, <laughs> but you just do it for, you know, messing around with some time and messing with the weights. There is zero lo logic to it. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you don't like it, uh, let them keep board warriors keep coming at it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, since we took so long for the squats, we decided to uh, uh, change it up a little bit. We're now gonna do hamstring curls with one-legged leg presses. Too big for this thing, man. <laughs> mm, feels so good. Okay, so we have done the four supersets of the single leg presses and hamstring curls, and now it's time for adduction and abduction. Heavy weight. part that we are not recording is stretching. Don't forget right. to stretch after you work out. It's very, very important. So before you start training the warm up and after you finish stretching in the cool down. You heard that right. Okay, thanks for watching the whole leg workout and we're gonna wrap it up with some stretching and I'll see you in the next video. Ram Ram. Yeah.